Nyasi Yorubun, we're back. And now we're gonna discuss about preposition. So for exa first example is meet, which is under in English. So this is meum. In order for you to tra uh, translate or romanize in English, as I recommend it to you, uh, it is more nicer if you have this this one you make this one if you're not familiar yet with the korean alphabet or this one has every names of the korean alphabet and its romanization while this one is um, directly the uh, equivalent uh, romanization of every K korean uh, alphabet so here this is meum M, then I, uh, E in Korean, then I in English, then this is T, letter T in romanization. So this is Nit, this is how you will read. Then under is Are, this is A. Uh, a, this is silent, then A, real, because it's used as second, is R, then this is A, A, E, here it's A, E, so, are, under, inside, an, in general but if has small space it's so this is um silent then ah uh, then nian and this is so this is shit s shit here is here shit so S then O as in omon uh, oi oi so this is O then Kyok this would be in the la as uses in the last so it will be K okay. so inside so beside is Yok silent then Yo Y E O. Let's find the U. This one. Y E O. Then let me just create that one. Then the, that one, that letter oh, is here. Mm -mm. P. U. Mm, this is P. Yup. Beside. Then front is up. Silent. Then ah. Uh. Then yup. Up. Then back or behind is D. This is D. Good. D. Then. E. This one. W I D. Then above is V. This is silent. Then the same here. V. Then uh, there are two kinds of outside is pakat then pa then the sub uh, this one is already for the um how to uh, make a korean sentence so in making a korean sentence first is the subject 
then the subject marker, then the location, the preposition, which is that one, then the particle. So let's go to the example. Example, the slipper is under the bed. The slipper is the subject, so here, slipper. So the Korean term for slipper is shin. Then, um, the location. Where is the slipper? It's under the bed. So first is the bed. Chimde in Korean. Then the preposition, which is that one. It's under mid. But when you use the preposition, you just add a. And that would be the uh, particle to be add in the um, preposition. Then isomida that is is on uh, is it it is isomida so if trans this one the Korean uh, sentence would be shine um the shin uh if you would go back to the um e and ga uh, you would add that one uh, that would be the subject and this is the subject marker e or ga um they use e because it the um, um korean word ends with a consonant so e will be used but if will it if it ends with um vowel uh you will use ga so here shin ends with consonant so use e shinni shinni chimde mitte isomnida so chimde is the location where the slipper is then the preposition plus the particle particle e mitte then isumida chinne chimde mitte isumida slipper then the bed then the under so we, you'll just have to be familiar familiarize with this pattern subject subject marker location preposition then the particle this is the subject then the location is the bed so here is the bed then a uh, subject has a this is the subject marker e then uh, location as i said then the preposition then the particle a then is the so the other example is there is a notebook above the desk so first is the subject which is the notebook the korean word for notebook is gong check gong check then the subject marker which is the e since it ends with consonant you're just gonna add e then gong chegi uh the location where is the notebook it's in the desk so check sang then the preposition ba it is above then isomnida gong chegi check sang mie isomnida so maybe that's it for now um kindly uh watch my next videos for the other examples of uh korean sentences thank you so much for watching